Hi everyone, I've just been running a part through Cam Assist in Mastercam and I am going to use a new feature. Previously, to get a cycle time estimation report, I had to use the separate cycle time estimator and I had to preset my Mastercam files ahead of time. With this new feature, I can launch a cycle time estimation report directly from a Cam Assist run on the part I am currently calculating. Let's have a look at how this works. So my file has finished processing in Cam Assist now and I get this message. I am going to select yes here to see the cycle time estimate report for this part. The data for this report requires that Mastercam generate the toolpaths, so let's speed things up a bit here while that processing takes place. Okay, now that Mastercam has finished calculating, let's have a look. When I hit OK here, the cycle time estimates view will be shown. I have a few previous examples in my queue here, but the most recent file is up at the top of the list. I am just going to clean up the queue now to only show the current file, but this method is useful for combining cam assist runs into a cycle time report, or set of reports. Sometimes we call this stacking the report. Now, moving over to the export tab, I am going to check the scale factor. This value helps me compensate for time differences between the estimation and what actually happens on the shop floor. I can also add in the setup time for each part, which could include material handling between jobs and other items. I will set the quantity of parts as well in this space. The export tab also allows me to set the location for the report file. Now let's export. Okay, I have opened up the report, which is just a basic CSV file, and done a bit of simple formatting. As you can see, the report contains a lot of valuable information about the part and a breakdown of the cycle times involved. I can see that my estimated time per part is 17 minutes and 24 seconds, while the time to produce all 14 parts is 6 hours, 5 minutes and 40 seconds. I might choose to adjust this time a bit further if I'm adding it to a customer quote, or if I'm using the time for estimating shop floor production, these values help inform internal projections. Further down in the report, I can also examine the specific times for each machine group, or operation, and the times for each operation type, like roughing. Each toolpath time estimate is also shown. With the cycle time estimation feature in Cam Assist, you can generate estimates based on the actual Cam program from realistic toolpath data. This means no more guessing or taking up your Cam programmer's time just to generate quotes. Even inexperienced estimators can benefit from using Cam Assist in their work. Thank you for joining us. In this look at estimating parts directly from Cam Assist, and stay tuned for more videos from the team here at CloudNC.